sandwich in Kent. He's preparing to host the Open, the oldest golf tournament in the world and one of the most prestigious. Well, the last time he came to Sandwich is back in 2011. It was a big boost for the local economy, particularly for hotels and guest houses. More than 180,000 people attended the event, spending on average £63 each day. Around £4.1 million pounds was spent on accommodation alone in Kent, and in total £13.5 million pounds was spent in the county during the event. It's one of the most coveted trophies in golf, coming to Kent this summer for the first time in almost a decade. But will the Open present business opportunities as well as photo opportunities? Business leaders in Sandwich met today to find out. In many ways, visitors are the best customers any company can have. They come here, they spend their money, they go away again. So this is a, a, a great thing for us in this part of the world. We wish they'd come more often. When are they going to spend their money though? If, they, if they're arriving by train if they're, or they're being shepherded straight into the golf course and then they go home by train, when, when is that opportunity to spend any money in the local economy? They certainly will. Uh, you ask anybody with uh, a room free, anybody with a house, many people are going away, some of them are going on a cruise and renting out their house for the period of the open championship. Do people really do that? Yes, they do. Yeah. If you look in uh, some of the windows, some properties, depending on where they are, you're looking at sometimes up to £20,000. In 2011, this tournament brought £24 million to businesses in the Sandwich area. This year, it's expected to bring £30 million. 100 million people will be watching it around the world. To get that kind of publicity would cost normally £50 million. Are you fully booked? We are not. At the moment, we keep in few rooms, uh, really, uh, until uh, uh, we get closer. But we are almost like the rest of the hotels in the area. Everywhere is fully booked. Sandwich hosted the first ever Open outside Scotland and 13 times since. Organisers are sure that lessons have been learned from previous problems. The station platform is being extended so that the extra long trains bringing 15,000 passengers a day won't keep the level crossing down. One of the causes of traffic jams in 2011. I think people will be kind if there are a few, a few problems with parking, a few problems with the roads. I think people will appreciate the opportunities of such an uh, amazing tournament bringing in over 200,000 people and globally watch is going to do for the area. Neighbours in Sandwich have their own meeting on Monday to discuss the Open's impact. But business leaders here hope that the return of golf's oldest tournament could be a win for them. Tony Green, ITV News, Sandwich.